Hi, I'm Lisa and welcome back to Life With Less Stuff. So today I'm going to share with you how I was able to prepare meals for my family all week without eating out. Now, you're probably thinking, so what? Big deal. Maybe you cook and prepare food all day every day of the week. I did not. We were eating out way too much and I wanted to change that. So I made a plan to eat at home every day last week. And you might be thinking, what has this got to do with life with less stuff? Stay tuned so that I can tell you all about it. So on this journey of life with less stuff, what I've realized is that getting rid of my clutter has freed my time. It has freed my mind. It has freed me up to do the things that I would like to do in my home and with my kids and with my family and it is making a huge difference. So one difference is for me, the fact that when my kitchen is a disaster and it's not tidy and it's cluttered with things, which was all the time, I did not feel like preparing a meal. I didn't feel like cooking. I didn't want to have to clean before I cooked. It was a nightmare, right? So now, now that I've decluttered, now that I do my dishes every day and I keep it tidy, I don't mind going and preparing food. So I had a goal last week to go to the store, to get my groceries, to make a meal plan, and to prepare every meal at home. Now, yes, we did have sandwiches for lunch sometimes, something easy. It wasn't home cooked meal all the time. Uh, frozen pizza was part of our plan, but the point was we did not eat out all week. And this has only happened for me since I have started decluttering my life. It is an amazing transformation not just my home because there's plenty more to do there but in my mind in the availability of my mind to think and be able to do things that i wasn't able to do before i was stuck with clutter in my mind i was stuck with what else i had to do next and i was stuck with feeling like overwhelmed like i'm not going to be able to accomplish what i need to accomplish on a daily basis having less clutter and less stuff to manage in my life has helped me to be able to focus on business, focus on family, focus on feeding my family. It is making a tremendous difference. As you can see, they're not all like fancy meals or anything, but I'm so excited that I was able to accomplish this goal this past week. I'm going to continue and move it forward. I'm going to add new goals and try to succeed with those as well. If you haven't started on your decluttering journey yet, I encourage you to get started right away. It makes such a difference. And if you're not sure how to go about starting that, stick with me because I'm going to be doing a lot more decluttering here on this channel. I will be sharing any tips and tricks that I've learned from others and from doing this myself for the past four months. I'd love for you to share with me what your struggles are when it comes to decluttering. Where are you hung up? Where are you feeling overwhelmed? Because I promise you, others are feeling the same way. I hope you'll stay with me and hit that subscribe button. I am new to YouTube and so you may be my very first subscriber or my second and that's a big deal and I would say thank you, thank you, thank you in advance for that. Then you can say later down the road, I knew her when she had no subscribers. <laughs> hit that subscribe button, hit that like button and I'll see you next time.